Hey there everyone, this is Danielle playing some more Pokemon Swoosh. Uh, last time we made our way into Galar Mine number 2 here, uh, which is where we need to go to meet Kabu apparently, who is the next uh, gym leader, the fire type gym leader. Uh, so we've talked to this guy, there was a battle with Bead just here, but we handled it pretty easily. So we're going to keep going this way. Uh, that's a stun fisk in the ground there. Uh, if you don't want to get caught by them, watch out. Uh, if you do want to get caught by them, just walk on them and yeah, they pop up. Uh, one of those tricked me in the previous video, but now I know what they're doing, so I, I know what to expect and I can take him out pretty easily. Uh... Oh, Sucker Punch? Rude. Eh, doesn't matter, I need the experience, so let's keep fighting. Does Psycho Punch take priority if it works? Maybe? Hmm, let's have a look at that. Level 30, yeah. Ooh, U-turn, is that good? Let's have a look. U-turn, after making its attack, the Pokemon rushes back to switch places with a party Pokemon in waiting. Interesting. So you use it, and then you have to immediately switch? Is that how it works? Because I could replace Bind with that, and it's much stronger. Might be useful. Hmm. Oh yeah, yeah, Sucker Punch has priority. If the other player, if the target is ready and attack, then you hit them first. Okay. Uh, I think I'll Lich Bind and get U-Turn, because that sounds interesting to me. I got Bind, learned U-Turn instead. Natalie grew to level 25. Peter grew to level 25. The move Bite. Heck yeah, learn Bite. Bite's great. Big fan of that move. Uh, let's see. We're going to drop Growl, because no one ever uses Growl. <laughs> and yeah, we're going to place it with Bite, because Bite is great. There we go. Ba -do -ba -do. Cool. Uh, there's another Stun Fisk there. Uh, I haven't been fishing, and I probably should be. Okay, I can see something over there. So I wait across this water and get to that Pokemon? Hang on. Let's have a quick look over here. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not sure how you would reach that. Maybe we can get like a swimming ability or something later? I think your bike can be taught to cross water at some point in the game. When I'm tired of work, it's time for a battle. I'll show you the muscles I've built up. Worker Yvonne. Oh. Oh, Worker Yvonne is so strong, and she winked at me! Oh, I'm gay. <laughs> She's got a rock and roller. Uh, that's that's a rock type, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, you've got a problem. Water poles. Goodbye, rock and roller. I think she has another Pokemon, though. Timber. I forget what Timber's type is. Fighting, maybe? Yeah, let's try Water Pulse and see what happens. That was easy. <laughs> maybe I'm a little over-leveled for this part of the game. The muscles I use for work and for battle are different. 2100 money for winning. Thanks, Yvonne. Do -do 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 -do. Found a Grip Claw. I'm going to be held by a Pokemon. Extends the duration of multi turn attacks such as Bind and Wrap. Interesting. Uh, there's another Stunfist just there. Oh, Team Yell, here we go. Excuse me, mate, sorry to bother you. You're one of them taking part in the gym challenge, right? Crikey, but that's really something. I'd love a battle against a great trainer like you. Well, look at you, Daniel. Surrounded by adoring fans, eh? You'll even be showing up Lee pretty soon. Oi, jog on, mate. Can't you see we're in the middle of a conversation here? Yeah? And can't you see that I'm Hop, the trainer who'll be your next champion? Oh, so we got a joker here, eh? You're so funny, I forgot to laugh. You think I'm joking? I'll prove it then. I think a battle with you lot would definitely go with some laughs. Let's take them on together, Danielle. You ready, mate? Yep, let's go. 
the two of us were endorsed by the champion himself. We'll show you just what that means. Well, if you insist, Team Yell's gonna teach your kids the gym challenge is no joke. You better not be yellow. What did this other kid have to come waltzing up here for, eh? I just wanted to knock off challenges one at a time. Huh. Sucks to be you. You were challenged by the Team Yell Grunt and the Team Yell Grunt. It's awkward that they didn't code that to work better. Lanoon and Thievil. Go Cynthia. Go Wooloo. You really gotta catch something better than that Wooloo. Uh, what a pulse. Uh, I'll use it against Thievil. It's effective. There we go. Night Slash, huh? My goodness. What's that, special attack? Eh, that's fine. Ooh, close. Uh, let's try attacking the Linoon as well, just so I'm spreading out my fire. Do they have backup Pokémon? I don't know. That's not good. Yeah, special attack fell again. Does the other kick go to the other Pokemon? Or? No. Okay, well, that's useless. Okay, I do have backup Pokemon, so I may need to put out some extra Pokemon of my own. Um. <laughs> hmm. Uh, I can drop in Charles, who's pretty good. Or Carl, maybe? Let's try Charles. I'm not sure what the types involved are, because I'm real bad at that. Torment, huh? Subjected to Torment? I don't, I don't know what that means. Why are you not just attacking the Linoon that's already been hurt? Come on. Uh, I'll attack the Linoon that's already been hurt. There we go. Okie doke. Now I've only got one thing to work with. Sand attack? Uh, dropping accuracy is so annoying. No one likes when you do that. Oh, they have more? Okay, I thought that was the last one, but it was not. Alright. Um... <sighs> Annoying. I really hope Hop has another Pokémon. Corvusquire, that's more like it. There we go. The opposing team is too nervous to eat berries. Alright, if you say so. Oh yeah, that's right. Pancham is paralyzed. That's what I'm talking about. Uh, sand attack. Rude. Used pluck? I don't know what that does. Stop evading our attacks, it's so obnoxious. I guess pluck is an attack. Okay. Opposing Pancham's attack and special attack rose. Uh, spark. Oop, no, no. Will that work? 
Hopefully. Okay, good. Critical hit. Pancham fainted. Goodbye, Pancham. Why would you use work up when you're paralyzed? Like, there's a good chance that you won't get to do it, but and then if even if you do, you're not getting to attack. Are you gonna yell at us because we up and yell lost? If I'd used a horn, would I've had a better chance of winning? You're using a horn. That little mug's the champion's little brother. Guess that's what you get when your older brother's not useless. I know we're team yell, but we'll leave quietly once we're beaten. Nice one, Daniel. That's my rival for you. Now then, where could Kabu have gone off to? Let's keep going. Maybe he's farther in. Uh, okay, I would have liked a heal. Uh, I guess I'll go back and get a heal. <laughs> You're not going to give me one. Didn't even offer. That's right, I am quite the trainer. <laughs> there we go. Drizzle the rest of your team should be all better now. Thank you. Tummy. Okay, here we go. Huh, you can bike directly over the, the trap. Pokemon thingies on the ground, and they can't get you if you're fast enough. Neat. Um, I think I have one of these. Hello. What is that? Oh, it's Dreadnought. That's right. That's, um, Nessa has one of those. Hello, Dreadnought. Um, I guess I'll just use Water Pulse. Okay, yeah, that's about half, so I'll use Water Gun, which should use less, do less damage. Hey, I was going to use Water Gun, you copier. Ah, oh, dang it, accidentally pressed A again, dang it. Oh, uh, that's going to knock it out. Yeah. Goodbye, Dreadnought. Level 31, level 23, level 28. Level 26, level 28. Ooh, the move Charm. Maybe. What does Charm do? The user gazes at the target rather charmingly, making it less wary. This harshly no lowers the target's attack stat. I mean, I'm probably not going to use it, but it's still better than Tackle, so maybe I'll use it. Charles forgot Tackle and learned Charm instead. Da, 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 something shiny over here. Oh, a star piece. Cool. Hmm. A bag of soft sand. None to be held by a Pokemon. It's a loose, silky sand that boosts the power of ground type moves. I don't think I have anyone that uses ground type moves, so there's not much I can do with that just yet. Steam power can send any opponent flying. Alright. Rail Star Vincent. Sent out Drillbur. That's a, like a mole or something? Yeah. I think they're ground type. Mm. Oops. Goodbye, Drillbur. Oh. Uh, Onyx, that's rock type, but it's also steel, so... I'm gonna try to use water, I'm not sure if it's good. Against both halves of that type, or not. I'm guessing it probably is, yeah. <laughs> Level 26. What incredible power. Guess I was the one sunk flying. Got money for winning. 
Okay, this should be a TM, right? Yep, Sand Tomb. Use the traps to target inside a harshly raging sandstorm, sandstorm for four to five turns. Or more if you have that uh, move, that, that item that boosts that thing. You know the one. Is that Kabu? Thank you to help me out with my training team, y'all, but I must say, it's unforgivable for you getting in the way of a car call hard at work. We weren't getting in its way, we're trying to cheer it on. Still, you did number on us. Oh, you did number on us in that Pokemon battle, so it's time for Team Yell to scarper and give a morale boost elsewhere. There they go. Cheering is one thing, but one shouldn't get in the way of honest work. Gore. That's Kabu, man, he's wicked. No wonder he's the fire type gym leader. Ah, uh, you were the trainers endorsed by Leon. Hop and Danielle, am I right? I'm just training right up into the last moment so I can guarantee the perfect match when I face you gym challenges. I specialize in fire type Pokemon, and the water type Pokemon in Galar Mine number two are the perfect opponents to train against. Regardless, it's getting late. Just go straight once you get out of this mine, you'll reach Motorstoke. Get a good rest at the hotel and make sure you're both in your top condition. Come on, Carcoll, time for you to head on home too. I'll make sure you get there safely. Go. We're going to be on fire tomorrow. Okay, so we go back to Motorstoke to do uh, this next bit, which is an interesting choice. I remember Lee talking about Kabu. He said that a lot of gym challenges give up because they just can't beat Kabu. Man, now I'm getting all fired up too. Um, okay, well, I chose the water type starter, so I don't think a fire gym is going to be a big problem for me. But, you know, we'll see. Okay, so it's taken us back to Motorstoke, or near Motorstoke. That car call from before, I guess it must have been here on a job. You do know about Poke Jobs by now, Poke Jobs by now, right? I do. Of course you do. Now, I'm Cream Cracker. I'm for the buddy who drop in and some sleep. Come tomorrow, that fire gym leader car will be better be ready because I'll be coming for him. Okay, are we in the wild area or are we just outside town or whatever? Uh, I can't move the camera, so I guess this is not the wild area. An amulet coin, an item to be held by a Pokemon. It doubles any prize money received if the holding Pokemon joins a battle. Uh, hello, Sororu. You're fighting type, right? I have no idea what's good against you. I have got to learn my type advantages. Okay, that was okay. Wasn't great. Uh, let's try Sucker Punch. Not very effective. Worked though. Revenge. Oh my. Uh, I'll try another Water Pulse. Hopefully I can get you low enough. Oh, what? All right then. Okay. What's this sign say? Motorstoke outskirts. So if I have a look at the map, I should be. Yeah, we came through the through the mine from over here back to here. You can see the mine is just there. So I don't want to. Um, there's a battle just over there, and I'm a little concerned about that fact. Uh, Let's just run through the grass here and get to Motorstoke that way. Watch out for cops. Okay, yeah, then we can heal up. A clever feather. There's something else shiny over here. A health feather. Something else. A swift feather increases the speed base points of a single Pokemon. Another swift feather. Okay, now I'm in Motorstoke. Let's find a Pokemon Center. Uh, that's the gym. I'm pretty sure there's a Pokemon Center just along this road, so just keep going this way. There it is. And then we can go back and fight that uh, one trainer in the outskirts. Do, 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 do.
Tummy. <lacht> I think the, the bike boost should recharge every time you switch between areas. So you can just use it immediately when you get back. Hello. My Corviknight got all rested up, so it's already head off on its next Poke job. Alright, you were blocking this path earlier with your Corviknight. And now you're not doing that. Because we're allowed to come in this way now. Okay, let's defeat this cop. Hello, hello. What's all this then? Fancy a scrap with a copper? Yeah, I'm gonna defeat you. You're challenged by police officer Raymond. Sent out Growlithe. Oh, you're in for a bad time, evil cop man. <laughs> oh, Intimidate. Intimidate always weirds me out. Like, I'm, I, I have a what is that, near, like an 8 level advantage and a type advantage? Why would I be intimidated? Hmm. I know it's just a game mechanical effect, but it just, it doesn't make sense. That's all you had? Why are you wearing all those Pokeballs? You've got some Pokemon with you there. Your battle technique is bang on too. You got, well, I defeated a cop and robbed him, so that's good. Take that jerk. You have no problems traveling alone. I've seen enough to know you can handle yourself. So he's wearing a belt with six Pokeballs on it, but he's not using more than one Pokemon. Classic cops, I guess. Hello. Young Pokemon trainer, won't you honor me with a battle? I will honor you with a battle. Madame Carolyn. Sent out Yampa. Oh, it's Yampa. Everyone loves Yampa. Go on, Cynthia. I know you can do it. Okay, so Yampa's electric type. Alright, water, water. Yeah, electric is strong against water, but water is not weak against electric. It's very confusing. So I can just use water pulse and we should be okay. Yep. <laughs> is that all you had? Oh, nope, Swoobat. Yeah, I can fight a Swoobat. I think they're, what is it, Flying Dark, maybe? No idea. Air Cut is a flying move, I'm pretty sure. Pretty much just mashing A seems to do the trick. Goodbye, Swoobat. Oh, it seems you're already quite used to Pokemon battles. You've got 4800 for winning. Thanks, Madame Carolyn. I'm someone who can't help but look forward to seeing how strong you'll get. I'll support you from now on. Thanks. Um, I can see a bunch of pseudo woodoo walking around, which is pretty cool. Uh, some coughing. Oh, there's something over there. Hello. Three great balls. Thanks. Uh, pseudo woodoo is like rock type or something, so I might be able to catch it. Let's give it a try. I think there's exactly one of these in Gen 2 that you have to fight. Um, as part of the story. Um, and you can catch it, but you can also miss catching it if you're not careful. Um, I always catch it, and then I call it Sandwich. I'm going to call this one Sandwich too, because that's how I roll. Oh, using Mimic, so learned water balls, I see. Is that like replace Mimic for the rest of the battle? I, I don't know, I haven't I haven't used Mimic. Oh really? That's just rude. Okay, I need to damage you like a tiny bit. Um I could just try again. Let's try again. There we go. Suda Woodoo was caught. Gareth's Crudo, level 24. I'm still in the move Fire Fang. Yeah, let's get that. That sounds cool. Uh, let's see, what is it? Level s it's 65, 95. Okay, so it's a lot stronger than Ember, but it's a bit less reliable. Hmm. 
Let's replace Agility, I think. Although I have a lot of fire moves. Might drop Ember. There we go. But -ba I'm. It disguises itself as a tree to avoid attack. It hates water, so it will disappear if it starts raining. Yeah, I'm gonna call this one Sandwich. That's just what I call pseudo woodies. And I'm only gonna catch the one, so. There we go. Da -da -da, da -da -da. Mm. Leave me alone, throw. Um, I guess let's go rest up because the game told me to go to the inn and then we'll call that a video. Uh, the inn is just past here because that's the that's the gym. The inn is this one. <gasps> Money's here. Oh, what a cutie. Oh, she's so pretty. Hi, sweetie. Uh, challenger, Jan challenger, da the challenger Danielle, right? I've given it your all, even this late, huh? Hey, help me with something for a sec. I want to see if I'm ready for the next leg of the gym challenge. All right. Wicked, got some fight in you, huh? I'm gonna fight her. Oh, what a cutie. You were challenged by Pokemon trainer Marnie. Oh, I want to give her a cuddle. So not uh, Croagunk. Oh, she does the leg thing. I bet you learn it from Nessa because she already did that gym. I feel awful if I lose, but there's no way I'm gonna. Oh, I'm, I'm gonna feel bad when I defeat her easily. I'm, I'm sorry, Marnie. Dry skin? Wait, what? You, are you immune to water type moves or something? Is that a thing? Uh, alright. Well, what type are you? Like, poison? Poison fighting. Um, what's good against that? Oh, it shows me all the moves. Hang on. Um, hmm. Well, I can't use water, but I can use pretty much anything else. So let's try. Let's try incinerate. Seriously, is there an ability that makes you immune to water type moves? Because that is really powerful. Revenge, yeah, that's fighting type. Super effective, huh? Hmm. Well, incinerate time, here we go. Okay, good, that's good. That's what I want. Ooh. Uh, if I go first, I should take out Crow Gunk and then I can try something else for the next one. Okay. Sorry, Marnie. Ba -da -ba -dum. Scraggy. Uh, that sounds like a rock type, so I guess I'll try Cynthia again. But it might have the immunity to water like the previous one did. Maybe. I didn't know that was possible. Oh, that looks adorable. Uh, water Pulse? Oh, confusion, that's what I like to see. Used headbutt, I think I'll be okay. Yeah, they didn't do much damage. Okay, we're doing fine. We are doing fine. God, Pony is so pretty. I love you, Marnie. More Peko. Uh, more Pico? It'd be no fun if things ended just yet. That's why we aren't giving up. Oh, look at her little friend. Hmm, I think this move expresses my feelings. What do you think? Use bite. You feel bitey? Oh. Oh. I didn't know that was a thing Morpeko did. Is it like, depending on what type of move you use, the Pokemon's type changes, or...? Interesting. Bada -ba -dum. Bada -ba -dum. The move Rest. Um, I'm unlikely to use Rest, but 
a stockpile isn't very useful, so I might replace it with rest. Adabinum. Adabinum. You beat me. Guess you must not be too bad after all, huh? You got 3120 for winning. God, she's so pretty. I love you, Marnie. Guess I better get to bed and rest up for tomorrow. You better get to sleep too. Ooh, bah, bah. Look at her cool boots. Oh, I love you, Marnie. What a sweetie. Do, 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 do. The next morning. Morning, Danielle. Morning, Marnie. That friend of yours already went off to challenge the next gym. Carpu's lead card is supposed to help against him, but I ended up with a few copies, so I'll give you one. Don't look so chuffed, it's no big deal. You got Carpu's lead card. Put the lead card in your album. Take this too, a little something for our battle yesterday. Two burn heels. Thanks. You'll have no trouble beating that man of fire Carpu chap, right? Why don't you get over, over to Motor Stoke Stadium and get that gym badge already? Uh, she said the same thing, yeah. I wanted to see if she had said something else. Is there a cuddle button? I'm gonna give her a hug. Give her a hug. I love you, Marnie. Well, um, yeah, so next up, we're gonna go over to the gym and actually challenge Kabu. It'll probably not be too hard because I picked the water starter. <laughs> oh my goodness. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Uh, can I boot her snoot? Is that a button? Mm, doesn't look like it. Alright, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Next time, we'll get the fire gym badge. Almost certainly. Because it is not gonna be hard. <laughs> Bye! I just noticed when you go down the stairs, you put your arms out to, to balance yourself. That's adorable. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my goodness.